Aloha and mahalo for joining me. I'm Janin and I have a question for you. Do you treat your clothes differently depending on how much you paid for it? And this seems to be something that's pretty common that I've noticed is that if someone paid a lot more for their clothes, they tend to be really careful with it and they treat it well and they wash it or they dry clean it or they wash it carefully or if it has to be dry clean, they dry clean it and they tend to behave differently in their clothes if their clothes is a lot more expensive. Because you know, I've noticed that if you pay a lot of your hard earned money for something, you tend to take care of it a lot better. And I've noticed that if somebody has paid, you know, a really cheap price and if it was on sale, then they don't seem to really care as much about how they treat it. And even when they're wearing it, they don't seem to really be so careful as to what they're doing or how they're behaving in their clothes, right? And like sometimes if you're eating and you spill something on your clothes and it was cheap, you just seem to just pass it off like, ah, oh, that's no big deal because I really didn't pay much for it. But if it was something a little bit more expensive or a little bit more dressy like this blouse, you know, you tend to get a little bit more upset because, you know, you paid a lot of money for it. But I would say even if you did pay a really inexpensive price for it or you didn't pay much for it, I would say still treat it like it was something that was a little bit more expensive. I think if you get into that mindset of thinking about how you treat your clothes, it really shows because you tend to act differently when you're wearing something a little bit more expensive versus how you act if you're wearing something a little bit cheaper or you didn't pay much for it or it was on you got it on a really good deal or you got it on sale at a really cheap cheap price but if you tend to act like you care about your clothes no matter how much you paid for it or even where you got it from it'll make a really big difference in in how you are standing and how you're sitting in your clothes or how you think about it. Now, I know sometimes these little things just seem really trivial or, you know, you might be saying, well, who cares, you know? But I've noticed a difference in women when they're wearing clothes that are more expensive, how they treat it, how they behave, how they sit, how they stand. You know, if they are eating, they're a lot more careful with you know, making sure they don't get any food stains or spills on their clothes. And then I've also noticed women who, you know, are, are wearing something more casual and, you know, it doesn't look as dressy or expensive. They tend to not really care. But I would say, I would challenge you to change your mindset and really be aware of how you're treating your clothes, no matter what price you paid for it. Because even if you got it on sale and it was really inexpensive, you know, you're using your hard earned dollars. Everything that we buy, right, usually comes from our hard earned dollars. I mean, unless you, you know, have money given to you and you're not earning it. Of course, that's a different story. But most of the times we usually buy clothes that we work hard for. Or we buy clothes with the money that we work hard for. So I would say be aware of that. You know, it's really important that we take care of the things that we have. Your clothes will last a lot longer when you really care for it and take care of it. And especially when you're washing it, you know, a lot of things should be washed either on delicate cycle or should be hand washed. And I know we live in a busy world and sometimes people don't even want to be bothered with hand washing, but I would encourage you to change your mindset to wash those things that need to be hand washed so they last longer. You know, we live in such a throwaway society, right? Like if something gets ruined, it's like, ah, we'll just throw it out because I can just go get another one or I can buy another or I could go and buy um, something to replace it. But you know, if you take care of it, you don't have to be throwing it out. Just take care of what you have and be aware 
of how you're treating your clothes and how you're wearing it. Now, there are a lot of washing machines that have like a really um, delicate cycle where it's almost like you're hand washing it. So if you have one of those washing machines, I would suggest start washing majority of your clothes in a delicate cycle because you have to remember when you're washing your clothes, right? It's going around and around. If you have a front loading washer and it's just beating your clothes and eventually the fibers start to wear out. And, and it's even worse if you have a top loading washer where you know it's going around like this thing in the washing machine is, is agitating it this way, right? It tends to pull at your clothes. Take care of what you have so that it'll last longer. And I encourage you to think differently about your clothes. And I just wanted to talk briefly about something so simple like this that can make a big difference in, in what you're wearing. We all have to wear clothes, right? So why not take care of what you have and what you're wearing? And please let me know if you have any questions and please subscribe to this channel so that I can share all the things that I know with you. And I have a 20 minute complimentary consultation if you're interested in working with me. And please share this video with anyone you know who would get great value out of watching it. And please subscribe to this channel. And I hope you have a great day. Aloha.